Well, this weekend, Caracol is hosting its annual Christmas tree sale, but it'll be a lot smaller than in years past. Local 12's Clancy Burke is here in the studio to tell us how the nonprofit is overcoming some challenges this holiday season. Clancy? Hey, Sheila. Well, this is not the year to wait until last minute to buy a tree. Because of supply chain shortages, there aren't as many out there. And because of that, nonprofits that rely on Christmas tree fundraisers won't raise as much money. I was there yesterday as Caracol unloaded trees at Growing Trade Pet and Plant in Northside. That's where they're having their sale this year. And even though they won't raise as much money, every bit helps. The nonprofit's mission is to positively impact people's lives in the fight against HIV. Their number one goal is to prevent HIV, but they also provide services to help those who are infected. Even amid the pandemic, their mission is too important to slow down. Executive Director Linda Sider said throughout it all, they've pivoted and they're always coming up with new ways to raise money. It's been a hard year in terms of um, raising money, and it is for all nonprofits in the world right now. It's just really difficult. But, you know, for us, the key has been, you know, being creative and being willing to pivot when we need to. For those who have been buying their trees from Caracol for years, this is a new location. Once again, it's Growing Trade Pet and Plant in Northside. It kicks off Friday from 11 to 4, and they'll be open Saturdays and Sundays from 9 to 3 while supplies last. Sheila. Thanks a lot, Clancy. Trees range in price from $60 to $155, depending on the size, and all of the profits go toward Caracol's mission.